Hi, I'm Stephen Downs. Welcome to the Connectivism and Learning course. This isn't the course, this is my homepage, but I want to take a few minutes to introduce you to the course and especially the navigation around the course. It takes a, It's fairly simple, but it takes a little bit of getting used to. So to get to the course, type federica.eu and enter it. The list of courses won't show up right away but they will show up. There are these square boxes here. The Connectivism course is right here. You can get into it by clicking Enroll or by clicking on the I. If you're not already enrolled, clicking on Enroll will take you to the enrollment screen. Now you're on the introduction part of the course. There's two parts to the uh, overall screen. On the left-hand side is the content that you're working with. On the right-hand side is the overall course navigation. These top three links here take you to the federica.eu main site. So we don't need to worry about those for our course navigation. You can learn about the course and click on this arrow and about me a little bit and a link to my webpage and my email. If you want to get in touch with me, you can do that, no problem at all. And this takes you back to the about the course. The main navigation through the course is this lesson index. You can always get back to this lesson index by clicking on lesson index when it comes up. I'll show you what I mean. Let's go to a lesson. We'll go to the first lesson in the course, Lifelong Learning. We click on that and now we've entered the Lifelong Learning unit. So these, the lesson is divided into three units. Remember I said lesson index? Here's the lesson index. This takes you back to that navigation. This is your main navigation in the course. Click lesson index and we're back to lesson one, unit one. Once you're in the lesson, work on this left hand side. The right hand side where it says video lectures and images, that's just a listing of the resources. It's not really useful for navigation. It's useful only later if you're going back and looking for some specific picture or some specific picture or some specific video. Inside the lesson, your main navigation is this little arrow down here. I know it's hard to see, but this is what you're going to use. So watch the video. Anytime you see a video page, watch the video. Here we go. Hi, I'm Stephen Downs, etc and then click on the arrow and you'll get to the next page or the next slide. Many of the slides are text. Sometimes there's links in the text and you can click on the link to go to another page. Or if there's an image, you can click on the image. If you do that, the image will show up here on the right. If you want to see the image a bit bigger, click on this enlarge screen and it'll show you a larger version of the image. Not full screen, but bigger. Click on that to get rid of it. And now if we ever want to go back to our list of lessons, click on that button that says home and there we are, there's our lesson index. But we're still working our way through the units. So we'll click on the arrow again. Here's another image. Click on the arrow again. Here's some more text. Click on the arrow again. Here's some more text. Click on the arrow again. Now we finished unit one. We're into unit two, the second unit in lesson one. Watch the video again. Today we're going to look at some. And once you're done watching the video, click on the arrow again. And that's going to take you through the rest of the course. There's not a lot of text. It's fairly easy, easy and straightforward to read. Now we have another video. This is the video for unit three from lesson one. And we continue reading through. Again, text and images, 16 of 19, 17 of 19, 18 of 19, 19 of 19. And then we pop over into slide one. When we pop over like that, we're done the unit. So here's the list of the three video lectures from lesson one. There was one in unit one, one in unit two, one in unit three. Click to go back. Here's a list of the images, all of the images that we saw in the different pages. We can click on any one of those. It'll take us straight to the page. And of course, 
we can make it bigger by clicking on the enlarge screen like that. We go back to the index, go back to the first lesson, or we're probably ready to go on to lesson number two, just like lesson number one, and you continue on all the way through to the end of the course. So thanks, enjoy the course, and I'll be back to you with more.